this video, I'm going to introduce you to the Seesaw um, Community and School Library, and we will explore how you can use the library for ideas and even lessons that you can schedule and send out to your students. So to access the Seesaw Activity Library, I can click on Add and Assign Activity just to get back into my Activity Library. And as we've already spoken about, it initially takes me to my library. So these are all my activities, ones that I've either created um, and sent out to students or that I've um, saved and then modified and sent out to students. I have another two options here. I have a school library and a community library. Let's start by exploring the school library first. So the school library will take you to all the activities that are related to your school account. Um, and you can see they're organized by grade and they're also organized by the different um, teachers that have used them across the school. So at the moment, I'm in the fifth grade activity library and there are 22 activities in here. Say I teach kindergarten and I wanted to see what activities are available for kindergarten. I use the drop down um, box over here and select kindergarten and it will now show me all the kindergarten activities that we have available for the school. If I see something that I think is just fabulous and I'd love to use that in my classroom, um, I might just choose this one over here by Mrs. Adcock, the shape detective. I simply heart the activity. And what that does is it saves the activity to your activity library. So if I now go back into my library, just by clicking on the My Library tab at the top, you can see the activity is there in my library. And I can now use this activity and assign it to my students by clicking on the Assign button and then assigning it to my specific students, Assign or scheduling it to go out. Now, the other place that you can get some really great um, resources is the community library. So that's this link over here. So when I click on that, that will take me to the broader Seesaw community library. So this includes um, teachers from all around the world. It includes all subjects, um, lots of different kind of skill sets. Um, and these activities are available for you to like um, and save to your library and modify as well. So I'm just going to scroll down and you can see there's a broad range. So I'm just looking for fifth grade activities at the moment. I'm going to just pick second grade and it's just filtered out and given me all the different second grade activities that are available from all around the world. And you can see there's, you know, a broad range of curriculum areas and a broad range of skill set activities. Say I'm teaching um, something around um, selfies you know, or taking selfies. So this particular activity here, I've looked at it and I've thought, fabulous, this is great for my year two class. It works really well with what we're learning about um, at school. Again, if I heart the activity, it will save it into my activity library. Say I'm looking at an activity and it's very specific, say for America or another, another um, country. So if it's something around money, for example, is a good a good one to look at. Um, and I can specify in here, I want something for money. You can see there's lots of stuff here for money. Oh, here's a good one. So I'm going to heart that one and save it in my activity library. 